is a new sheriff in town. You've got to be very careful shorting these stocks if you think they're going to zero. This Reddit crowd organization, the whole move to find these very, very short positions, and then use this organized um, methodology. It's almost like this. We tried to do this years ago with institutional trading, and it didn't work. These guys are doing it on the internet, on social media, and it's working, and it's incredible. It gives a chance for new life. I, I see no problem with AMC raising capital here because now they can basically take their IP, which is their brand, and try and pivot. Whatever's left in movie going, I have no idea, but you can take a brand and you can take $200 million and you can fix it. And so if you're short this stock, you're really hurting. Jim Stewart, he said there's, no, there's a new sheriff in town. I mean, the point being, this is not your father's stock market that we're witnessing today and through this entire meme mania existence. No, it's not. I mean, it is a fascinating phenomenon, as long as you're not caught up in the turmoil. But, you know, I think a lot of people said, oh, my God, you know, this is not rational. But it is rational if you're one of these mean traders. Um, there is a methodology here. Obviously, they pick very uh, beaten down stocks, stocks that are thinly traded with high levels of short interest. Then they come up with a story. You've got to have the story. And they put that out on Reddit or other social media and they whip these traders into a frenzy. There's also this overlay of kind of an Occupy Wall Street feel here, so that the objective, for some of these traders at least, may not be to make money. It is simply to punish the short sellers, and in particular the hedge funds, which they think are shorting the stock. And again, if that is your perspective here, this trading is rational. Kevin, there's a methodology, according to Jim. There's a story, but what happened to the fundamentals? I thought that's the way we're supposed to buy and sell stocks. Well, the first thing you have to do, if you, and I've done this, I've joined the Reddit crowd. I ride with the herd. I have a Robin Hood account. I'm all over this. I'm looking at a plethora of communications, synchronized communications on this situation, unbelievably organized in a way I've never seen done before. So I'm watching, and I tell my own guys, do not short anything right now, because if you don't know where the herd's going next, you're behind the eight ball. So they're changing the behavior of the institutional investor, and the companies are taking advantage of it. I see nothing wrong with this. This is the new world. And if you don't get on board, you're going to get caught in a wicked short squeeze. There must be hundreds of millions of dollars being lost right now by all of those hedge fund guys, whoever they were, that said AMC is going to zero as a result of pandemic changing people's streaming behaviors and what the hell they watch their content. Wrong oh, that's not what's happening here. This company has breathed new life into it by getting cash, taking advantage of a ridiculously priced stock. I'm not saying it's a buy or a sell, I'm just saying this is new and it's here to stay well, and it's changing behavior. Well, Jim, Jim Stewart, I mean, forget the hedge fund guys for a minute. Does it end badly for the retail guys? This new cohort who seemingly has fallen in love with the stock market over the last year plus and is enjoying themselves. Well, the, the fundamentals, as, as you mentioned, have nothing to do with this. They, they are not buying a stock that has anything to do with any common investing theme or, you know, which, of course, in the end, it's all about a share of future earnings.